my dear brothers and sisters when we have problems in our lives we normally focus on the problems when we have problems in our family in our relationship among our children physical problems sicknesses financial problem marital problem when we have all these problems choke us we get disturbed and confused depressed and we focus on the problems and we wonder how to get rid of this problem but what the lord wants us to be is you should not be problems focused but you should be jesus focused because if you are problem focused you will end up in sorrow and confusion and tension and fear but if you are jesus focused in jesus there is solution for all the problems when you believe this and when you focus on jesus you will be released from every pain and sorrow so the lord wants us to know he is greater than all the problems in this world god is greater than all the problems in the world praise the lord praise the lord let us read this word of god first now numbers chapter 14 verse 17 Let's read Numbers chapter 14 verse 17 we read Now and now and now therefore therefore let the power of the Lord let the power of the Lord be great be great in the way in the way that you promised that you promised when you spoke when he spoke saying saying Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. The Lord is slow to anger. The Lord is slow to and anger. And abounding in steadfast love. And abounding in steadfast forgiving love. Forgiving iniquity. Forgiving iniquity. And transgression. And transgression. But no by no means. But by no means. Clearing the guilty. Clearing the guilty. Visiting the iniquity of the parents. Visiting the iniquity of the parents. Upon the children. Upon the children. To the third and the fourth generation. To the third and the fourth generation. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Thank you Jesus. Thank you Jesus. Praise you Jesus. Praise you Jesus. My dear brothers and sisters, the Lord wants us to the power of the lord is greater than the problems that we face so the lord we should be not problem focused but jesus focused when Je- the mary magdalene was coming in front of the tomb of jesus there was a big stone at the entrance of the tomb and these ladies mary magdalene and others they were coming to this tomb on the way they were discussing among themselves who will remove the stone who will remove the stone but they did not stop going to the tomb they knew jesus is behind the tomb inside the tomb there is jesus therefore they they were focused on jesus therefore they continued the journey if they were focusing on the stone they would have stopped journey and search for help but they did not search for any help they didn't get any strong men along with them but they just came though there was something worrying them but they were focused on jesus therefore they came in front of jesus in front of the tomb when they came in front of the tomb the tomb the stone is already removed because they were jesus focused not the problem focused praise the lord praise the lord we all have problems we may tend to focus on the problem because we are all weak but let us focus on jesus Jesus was standing behind all these problems and confusions tensions he is capable of stamping on the problems and walk peacefully he is the lord who brought order in this disordered world he is the lord who walked on the raging and roaring waves of the sea he walked on the of water and therefore he is the lord who can solve all the problems if for your problems you may have only one or two or three solutions which you tried but failed and therefore you are hopeless you feel helpless but god says for your problems i have hundreds and thousands of solutions so don't get worried you focus on me i will focus on your problem if you focus on problem then you will have to settle it Praise the, Lord. Praise the Lord. Thank you Jesus. Thank you Jesus. The Lord is promising us just you be focused on Jesus, not focused on the problems. He will help you.